So Michelle has really sharp hip pain. She was on the treadmill yesterday, was it yesterday? Mm -hmm. Yesterday, and it just started shooting into her hip. So in this case, it's not pain coming from lower back. It's directly from the outer glute and into the hip socket itself. So move your arms to the side of your body. We're gonna go through, I'm gonna start out, uh, this is gonna be a pure activator adjustment. Mm -hmm. uh, she's showing short on the right leg here. Take a look at this. And you see how the right leg draws short? By right here, we're looking at mm -hmm. by a good centimeter, maybe 1.5 centimeters. I bring it up to position two, it evens. So it's short in position one, evens in position two. I'm gonna check the knees, but it doesn't make any difference. Sometimes the knee will balance it out. So we're not gonna start with the knee. We're gonna check, and we're not getting anything from the sits bone of the right. So we're gonna go to the opposite side for an AS ilium, anterior superior. We're gonna pull down on that and see if that evens it. And it does. You could probably see that it even. So now I'm gonna set that. There's three different contact points. We come just left of the second second sacral tubercle. We come on the superior uh, from S to I on the um, iliac crest. And then we come down through the spine of the ischium, which is a great landmark on the left ilium where there's one on the right, but we just did the left. Come look at this now, just from those three taps, we got that even. So you're probably wondering, what about a right hip? I am too, so I'm gonna have to keep looking. Squeeze your knees together and relax. That checks the pubic bone in the front. Actually, that's out a little bit. Without turning her over, let's come to this side. That works. So I'm gonna um, hit a landmark that I know that can sometimes push all the way through and balance out the pubic synthesis. And now, legs go even. Squeeze the knees together, which is what upset it. Relax, that's what upset it before. Now I got that even. So we still haven't gone to the point of pain, but I'm chasing the symmetry of the alignment first. Now I'm gonna bring the legs up to position two, it's even. I go to position three, which is we approximate it closer to the glutes. Bring the legs down, I look again, stays even. Now I'm going to internally rotate the hip. By bringing the leg out, I'm turning the hip in internally and that one's short, so there's something. We have an internally rotated right hip and it also shifted anterior. So we're gonna take out both at the same time. We're gonna take out the anteriority and the internal rotation. I'm gonna have the patient lift their hip up just a little bit and I'm gonna come under. Actually, I missed it, so I'm gonna do it again because I can feel, I can almost hear it when it goes back in. Let's check it now. So here, I'm gonna do it, stress it out before, which is internally rotating the hip staying dead even. Come look at this one more time, it's nice. Legs are perfect. Let's check in a few other directions. I'm gonna stress the hip superior, stays even. Posterior, I'm gonna grab a little tissue pull, pull lateral. That's good, let's just check the left hip just in case. Those are nice, that's fine, that's not gonna be the thing. Now we're gonna jump up to the fifth lumbar because I'm still curious about that because she was running. And switch arms please and both arms on the lower back. Good, it's balanced. Both arms to the top of the table. I just wanna see what some of the thoracics are doing. So you're gonna bring both hands up here. And now bring both arms down. Let's get you standing up for a second, moving around, see how you feel. And lean in both oh. ways. How does it feel now? Looser. Yeah, it's a lot looser, right? It's not as pinchy, yeah, right? Yeah, it's not as pinchy. It's like yeah. someone's grabbing a tissue inside. So, 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 so. so it feels yeah. a little better already, it right? Does. Yeah. Okay. So you did that. Yeah, th that's the big that, one. That that really. That was the one. Hit the mark. The um the hip was internally rotated and it pitched forward anterior. So when we took that uh misalignment out, it took a lot of pressure off. Yeah, definitely. definitely. That's it. <laughs>